However, so Julie Dion followed the law, the Freedom of Information Act, and say it should be released. Told Jamie Calvin initially that Laquan McDonald had died from 16 shots, nine of them in the back. And as a result of that information, he pursued the Freedom of Information request to get the entire autopsy report and to proceed with the legal case to secure the release of the videotape, which, as I said, proved up that Laquan McDonald was murdered by the police. Mac McCarthy said you violated the law by doing that, that you interfered with an ongoing investigation. You know, Gary McCarthy has to be held accountable for the fact that he was part of the police narrative that Laquan McDonald lunged at officers, that they were defending themselves when he was shot. When in fact, when the videotape was finally released, not because the police department chose to release it, but because they were forced to in the circuit court, the videotape clearly showed that Laquan McDonald was shot in the back. And you know, I don't know how Gary McCarthy can live with himself. You know, he covered up the murder of a young African-American man. So many of our young African-American and Latino youth you know, have encounters with police that result in problematic circumstances. And this is an instance where clearly, clearly, the police acted irresponsibly. And, and, and I am grateful that Jason Van Dyke has been found guilty of murder. Sure.